procedure. Check the patient profile for the doctor's order. Proceed to the patient room, knock three times, open the door. Greet the patient cheerfully. Good afternoon, Mom Noe. I am Miss Nella Jane, your caregiver for today, and I am here to insert your catheter. While the caregiver positions the patient into either letomy or frog position, wash your hands properly with soup and water can help prevent the spread of germs. Put your sterile gloves before proceeding on the procedure. With your other hand, take a cotton ball stiff on betadine to clean the vagina up and down. Do it for three times. Open the catheter. Fold the catheter. Leave at least 2 to 3 inches and do not touch the upper part. Take a good amount of lubricant and apply it on the catheter for easy insertion. Tell the patient to breathe to her mouth at the count of 3 to lessen the shock. You should see the urine flow at this point that confirms the correct position of the catheter. It is important to advance the catheter fully to its before application. Take the 10 cc syringe with sterile water on it and inflate the balloon. Secure the catheter to the tie with a micropore tape. This will prevent the catheter to be removed by sudden movements. Lift the side rails and put the urine bag on the side. Arrange the patient gown. Do your aftercare. Arrange the beddings. Remove your gloves and do the proper hand washing. In removing catheter, wash your hands properly, wear your sterile gloves, pull up the blanket, lift the patient gown, and remove gently the microporty one by one. Put the patient into a letomy position. Take the 10 cc syringe, then aspirate the catheter to deflate the balloon. After deflating the balloon, throw the syringe on the yellow contaminated bin. Before removing the catheter, tell the patient to breathe through her mouth at the count of 3. Remember, do not touch this part to avoid contamination. The double baggie and throw them to the yellow contaminated bin. Arrange the patient gown, arrange beddings so that the patient can be comfortable and dressed. Note, always put back the patient to the way you receive her. Do your aftercare, remove your gloves, wash your hands, and do your documentation.